Hi, this is Saev Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stand top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody, today guys we again will take a look at the Great British Pound because it's um, not really big sense to take take a look right now at the euro currency. Uh, you probably know that on Monday the Greece and the European Union officials will take the uh, emergency meeting that will be dedicated to the resolving of the debt crisis in the, in the Greece and the, even the banks will be closed on Monday in Greece so uh, that's why the value of our analysis will be really limited since everybody knows and understands that the Greece right now is the hostage of the solution on the Greek debt. That's why uh, it, it, it seems that's really not big sense right now to prepare an analysis on the euro currency. The better will be to take a look at it after the meeting and depending on the solutions that will, will come uh, as a result of this meeting. That's why, meantime, we will take a look at the Great, uh, great British Pound. But uh, the cable itself is, n is not uh, less interesting than the euro currency or even more interesting. Because market uh, technical is very attractive and it, it forms uh, really clear and promising patterns. As on the high time frame charts, as on the intraday charts, um, every, every type of the trader will find uh, is something interesting right now on the Great British Pound. So we will start from the daily chart. Uh, we suggest that you uh, will read our weekly analysis, this weekly report, because the foundation, the setup, mostly stands on the high time frame charts. And uh, in fact, guys, on the monthly chart, we have the setup for the possible brand body trade, brand body sell. But right now, we do not know from which level it will start, because it has the chance to start right from this 160 area, and at the same time, it has the chance to continue move high, slightly higher and start from the next monthly fib resistance. Uh, since uh, current upward action here is just the first month above the 3 by 3 moving average on the monthly chart. And we know that Brent, Brent Bader suggests uh, maximum 3 candles above the 3 by 3 where a market should hit the major fib resistance level. So, in fact, here month uh, Great British Pound has uh, two uh, additional months uh, to reach some few resistance and start brand body. At the same time, right now, market stands with very strong resistance area on the weekly chart. This is ABCD target that we have discussed on Friday. This ABC bottom minor 61A target that also weekly overbought and 50% fib resistance on the weekly chart. So that's really strong area. Uh, also, as you can see, market is creeping with the overbond on the daily chart. And we have two possible re reversal patterns here. First one is this uh, initial ABCD, ABC bottom. That has the target right here. It's 160, 10 probably area. And what's more significant is that market is forming the bottom line sale with the reversal point right at the same area, it's 127. Since market has created the reversal patterns and is creating the reversal patterns on the daily chart, and that is happening right at the strong resistance on the weekly chart, it suggests at least some meaningful bounce down, some meaningful retracement. Maybe it will not lead to the starting of the brand body itself, but we can't exclude this chance. That's also could happen. But if we, even we will suggest the uh, worst scenario that it will be just a retracement, this retracement probably will be meaningful and uh, it's worth of our attention as, as the trading opportunities on the, on the daily chart. Uh, also on the daily chart we we'll see that market has not quite reached this area. In fact on the daily chart we have two subjects for discussion. The first uh, we already have discussed is these patterns and that market has not quite reached it. So if we would like to take the short position you need to wait when this will finally happen. So when the market will continue to move high and hit this 160 targets and only after that we will start to think how is better to take the short position. Second 
pattern that could be formed here is based on a small stress and thrust up. As you can see, it maybe looks not very impressive based on the overall picture, but if you will count the number of candles, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine candles to the upside, this thrust up is suitable for brand body trade by itself because it's, it has nine, nine candles to the upside. And in fact, this upper direction was mostly stopped by the meeting of the overbought condition. So uh, that the overbought mostly have prevented market from the further upward continuation right to the targets. And that tells us two important moments. First of all, it's probably targets will be hit when the market will abandon the overbought area and will be able to reach this area. And the second, is that market, in fact, could form minor brand by the buy if retracement will happen. We can't tell that this definitely will happen because you know, guys, that market behaves differently in a very bad condition. So it could behave right here, as it right here was, right? This was a, uh, that was the brand by the buy, and we have traded it. Or, for example, it could creep with this very bad for a considerable period of time. In this case, market could reach this area directly. Or it could just show the flat action, for example, mid over bad stands flat and then continue move higher. That also could happen. But anyway, uh, that we would not care much what will ha how it will turn. Um, we just know that if brand body will happen, we could try to take the long position based on this pattern. For that purpose, for discussion of the brand body, we need the 4 hour time frame chart. That's the thrust of the double ripple, uh, sorry, of the brand body, potential brand body trade. And we have a level that market should reach to start the brand bot. This level stands a bit uh, extended, so it's a bit deep uh, FIP support. Um, I mean in terms of the distance, but not in terms of the quality of this level. Because from the point, from the quality point of view, that's just a 30% retracement. That's really not very significant bounce. But in the terms of the pips, so you can see this is approximately 200 pips. So that uh, not small distance at all. At the same time, this level in general suitable uh, for brand body, and if market will reach this level, it will not break the daily, the daily bullish setup because three retracement is the minor retracement, and it accompanied by the weekly pivot support one. And we know that until market retraces only till the weekly pivot support one, that's okay. That keeps the bullish trend valid because we know that weekly pivot support one should hold bearish retracements inside of the bullish trend until market stands above the weekly pivot support one uh, the bullish trend will be valid if market will pass through it that will be quite another story that's why this level is suitable as for a brand body as for uh, as, as a level that uh, keeps the bullish setup valid so our trading plan suggests two moments First of all, we will be watching for this possible bounce down. If this will happen, and market will reach this area, we will try to, to make the brand by the buy trade here. With the, uh, with the upside potential right to these targets. It's 160 area. That will be the target. If brand by the will not happen, and market just will continue to move higher, that's also suitable for us. In this case, we will be watching for the sell patterns in the 160 area and opportunities for taking the short position. That's the short-term analysis and the short-term uh, trading plan for the cable. And we will try to follow it in the beginning of the week. And later we will see what will happen. Here, guys, we, we, we uh, have to give you just one warning. That, uh, as you can see, we do not take into consideration some drastical events. For example, if Greece will uh, tell about the possible default, in this case, the cable probably will be treated as the safe haven currency in the European Union in a row with the Swiss franc. Uh, the attractiveness of the, on the Great British Pound uh, comes from low integration of the Great British Pound in the uh, European Union. So it, it, it stands with the European Union, but it, it has some bit different role in the, in the European Union compared to those who uh, countries that uh, stand directly uh, inside of the Europe. So uh, that's why many investors treat the Great British Pound as a uh, safe haven currency in Europe in, in, in times of the turmoils with the different countries. Uh, that's why if default will happen, 
we can't exclude that our view could be broken by the extraordinary event and market just could show the significant rally through this area. That's also could happen. But currently we can't def definitely say whether it will happen or not. That's why right now we follow just normal technical analysis. And normal technical analysis suggests the bounce down from the 160 area.